The New York Times is one of the most bigoted so-called newspapers in the nation, and Charles Blow, the left-wing editorialist who attacks the president, is one of the biggest bigot of the bunch that works for the New York Times. That's right, Charles Blow, you are a bigot. You accuse the president and all of his supporters of being racist, but you know, and I know, it's not about racism. It's about your hatred, your intolerance, your disgust with anyone that holds a different view than your left-wing socialist ideology. Your latest work of garbage is titled, Trump is a racist, period. But you take it even further. You do exactly what I have been warning our viewers about for over a year. You took the step to come out publicly and admit you hate all of us too. Trump supporters, your paper, the Times, allowed this bigoted piece to be printed under your own logic. That makes the Times bigoted too. Instead of secretly pushing this insanity on the world, something I always knew and warned about that Trump supporters are supposedly evil, you finally publicly admit it, Charles Blow, writing this. And finally, we have to stop giving a pass to the people, whether elected official or average voter, who support and defend his racism. If you defend racism, you are part of the racism. Now, you attack Trump supporters for calling out the hypocrisy and lies of the mainstream media. You base your allegations of racism in your latest piece off a comment that now seems more likely that Donald Trump never even uttered a comment concocted by a deceitful liberal Trump-hating Senator Dickie Durbin, that Haiti is an s-hole. With that, Charles Blow, you attack half the nation, millions of Americans you just can't stand. You see, Charles Blow, you are intolerant of our views about guns, of course, about limited government, and our support for the Constitution. Intolerant. Guess what the definition of a bigot is, Charles Blow? Take a look straight from the dictionary. A person who is utterly intolerant of any differing creed, belief, or opinion. Utterly intolerant. That's you, no doubt about it. And you make it clear. Hammering it home, actually, insisting in your latest hate-filled piece, I can only conclude that there is no real daylight between Trump and his base, they are part of his racism. Trump's base, 63 million people you just managed to disparage. NRA members, farmers, truck drivers, first responders, and so many more. Americans who love the country you clearly despise. Thank you, Charles Blow, for finally coming clean. Exposing yourself and the New York Times and the rest of your liberally elitist friends. That it is all of you who are the real bigots.